<laughs> Hello, welcome to the video. Athens has just updated with their 4th of July event, boys, and it is pretty fucking sick. You can kill Uncle Sam yourself. All you need to get is a declaration of independence. Now, the way to get a declaration of independence is through American Goblin. These are located all around Colon Colon America. Very, very easy to kill. 80,000 HP, and their drop table is a 1 out of 10 chance of getting a teleport, and a 1 out of 1,000 chance of getting 10 teleports. Sam's drop table is nothing short of amazing, and now you can get his very own set. Alright fellas, so the plan is to do one hour here at the Goblins, uh, I gotta start the timer right now, I am in full best in slot gear, obviously no one can really recreate this, but the question is how many kills can we get in one hour in full max DPS, drop rate does not affect, so although I've got 1700 drop rate bonus, it literally don't mean shit, I don't really know what they can max it, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm kinda just spamming every single Goblin at a time, but I feel like I might get KO'd anytime now, they are hitting a lot of zeros, maybe I will die. There we go guys, two teleports coming in already at kill count 69. Oh, what the hell, I actually got KO'd. We are coming up on the 10 minute mark and I can't believe how well it's going if I'm honest with you, 16 teleports in under 10 minutes. Twenty seconds to go on the clock and we're almost done. I thought we'd at least get 100, but we didn't quite. We got 81. We didn't land on any of the 1 out of 1,000 drops, which kind of does suck, but there we go. Let's just pause the timer right there. 81. Uncle Sam kills to go through. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah, the earner set is insane, man. And drop rate doesn't matter at Uncle Sam either. First kill, we got super box. Boom. Even more super boxes. Yeah, I reckon the majority of these kills are going to be super box loot. One thing I've noticed, I don't know if they're going to fix this or not, but you can actually 100% AFK this with auto retaliate. <laughs> The final Uncle Sam kill of the video. Come on, show me the money. I'm actually going to open these cash caskets right now. It comes to 24k cash and there we go. We got 800 super boxes, 120 ultras and 24k cash. That's the overall loot. This is something I'm very, very happy with. Now on Norman, I had to get 500 Zamorok, Krill and Vorkaf kill count to unlock Telos, but now I no longer have to do that. The only requirements to kill Telos is now 250 combat prestige and 20 advanced herb raids. So, so much easier and different difficulties. So we got the intermediate hard and they've also added some Telos multiplier for events that give a percentage of an extra key. The corrupted upgrader is something new that I've never ever seen before. 100% chance, but it takes a lot longer. Two days for 100% drop rate scroll. 1,099 lamps for 40 combat prestige. 750k cash. Oh, you can also expert junk tokens into cash. That's really, really cool. And it only takes six hours too. Finally, we have combat urns. Now to get this, you have to come over here, southwest of home and mine it. Let me get my pickaxe out. There we go, Inferno pickaxe. Thank you very much. You can go for the upgrade of 100% chance on the first, 75% chance on the second, and 50% chance on the third. I'm gonna go in for it right now. We got the melee urn. Having an urn in your inventory during a slayer task will start to fill up the urn based on your damage. So when it's full, you can then open the urn, I guess, to get this possible loot. I mean, I rarely ever use melee on Norman Price. So if I was to get this, it would kind of give me a little bit of an incentive to use my melee weapons, maybe. The rewards are insane too, a 50 bond, 25 bond, and a lot of cash there. A small quality of life update, they've added the examine option on pets and it will now tell you the drop rate boost and the damage boost on all of them. What do you do when you run out of YouTube video ideas? You do a secret millionaire. Got a new account that's about to be logged in for the first time ever. Just gonna set my security pin that none of you can see because I blurred it out because I am big brain. Make the character, make him look pretty newbie. Where did you find us from? 
Diddy's Cape, of course. Looking at the bank, you can tell that I've exferred a ton of items from the Diddy account over to this one. We got the Omni Box being the main prize, but we also have Monkey Nuts. Now, what I'm going to do pretty much after they've given me some advice or whatever it may be that I ask for, I'm going to give them a goodie bag pick, one through, let's say, 20. Whatever number they pick out the 20, so if they pick number four, they would go home with 50 Zamro boxes. The bunky note signifies $50 PayPal or 50 mil Ulster RuneScape GP, it's totally up to the player. Or I guess they can choose a $50 Olympus if they would prefer it, but anyways boys, let's try to find some people. Mr. Doing the CC said he spends all his time making money just to spend it on these green things and then I'm back to square one. He means limey tokens. Brother, trust me, I know your pain. He said, hey, brand new to the game buddy, have you got any tips and tricks? I hope he says abyss, I really hope he says abyss. Because I know for a fact that's where he is right now. So I'm hoping the boy actually explains the Limey token upgrade. It is quite hard to explain to a new player. He has come back with an answer saying Limey tickets upgrade them into bonds. You get them from boxes from bosses and doing abyss. I'm fairly new myself, he says. Uh, should we give him something for that or should we keep asking him a bit quick? You know what? Pick a number 1 through 20. Let's see what he says. He's going for number 10. Oh, Athens Warhammer. I don't know why I fucking clicked on the monkey notes. That's not too bad, actually. I'm also going to give him 500 so we can do the daily task. What a legend. Shout out to Mr. Durr. Oh, yo, this guy came up to me earlier in game and he actually said he loved the video. So what a fucking opportunity to get me involved. I just said to him, no problem. I'm new to the game. Have you got any tips of what I should be doing or any guide vids that I can watch? Yeah, on our Discord, there's a ton of guides. I'm actually kind of new myself. I started about two weeks ago, but it's definitely somewhere you want to go when you go to bed. <laughs> He must be talking about the AFK star. You can get pretty much everything here. Yo, cheers, mate. He was boosting my ego just a little bit earlier, so I'm asking him the big question. Any YouTubers you recommend? If he replies Diddy Skip, I'm giving him two fucking rolls. Diddy is definitely a good one, my boy. Give me two numbers, one through 24. Good luck, brother. Hopefully he lands on the monkey nuts. <laughs> you don't have a clue why. This guy is so fucking confused right now. Just give me two numbers, bro. You will not regret it. 7 and 24. Okay, so 7 and... That's a 25 bond. Oh, I can't even trade it. Fuck's sake. I'm going to give him 25 Olympus and the overload tokens as well. I think he deserves more. There we go, brother. Hopefully it helps out a little bit. So for the next one, I'm going to pretend to be a guy that's never, ever, ever done hope race before. And I'm really, really interested to see what it's like. So I'm going to put in the CC. Can anyone help me through a couple hope raids? And I guess we'll just wait around and see if anybody teleports in. Sure, Joe, I'll show you the ropes there. I see. Okay, we've got a group Iron Man on our team. All right, he's inviting me to the party, bless his soul. Let's do this, boys. You might get murked in one hit. There is only one way to find out. He says to pray melee when we're in, but I haven't even got that unlocked. You don't have prayer, do you? <laughs> Let me tank it all then. What a fucking legend. I would not do this for a brand new player. Imagine how lazy you have to be not to even get 43 prayer. So we're going to go through. Oh, I haven't... Uh, four. Oh my god, the tank. Ah, no. Okay, that, that, that's a test to see his patience. I can't die. Yep. I'll stay in room one. And he's actually going in for another one. I would have kicked the guy by now. This guy has given me so much information. Every single person that I've gone up to asking for help has helped me out to the extent. He's on the second to last room at the moment, so as soon as the boss is dead, I'll give him the option to choose two numbers. We're going to be generous. I really, really hope he lands on the Omni box and the Monkey Nuts if he gets both of them in one pick. And the Hope Devoyer is dead. He carried me through the entire raid. He deserves a good prize. And that right there is a Hope raid. 13 and 20 is what he's going to go for. 4, 8, 12. Oh, a $50 Olympus. And for 20, I actually haven't got 20. I'm just going to use the Athens Supreme Bow. All right, big man. I mean, to be fair, I think the Athens Supreme Bow is an upgrade to him. And a 50 Olympus Bond. It should help out his group Iron Man team. There you go, sir. Thank you very much. Thanks, man. Wait a goddamn second. I think I might have to help a noob out in need right now. What the hell is this guy doing with his pink dildo? <laughs> I'm being such a dick to Jeremiah. If he responds saying fuck off, I'll give him a slot. I just give him a PM. Not worth my time. He just tried getting a rise out of people. I just put, yeah, it couldn't be me. He just asked me for GP. Not my first rodeo, I just tend not to feed into them so I don't have the repercussion with staff or in general. Yo, you, you see, he's being smart. He's being smart. He's got a question mark. Uh, can you show me where Lumb <laughs> Lumbridge cows are? <laughs> Such a random fucking question to a guy he thinks is taking the piss. You just said where they are. 
in Lumbridge. Take me? I cannot. Then you're saying what you need cows for? You can't even kill them. Oh no, what has this turned into? <laughs> I've let him know in the Discord DMs that it is in fact me. So Jeremiah, 1 through 19 pick. Good luck, brother. 14, 4, 8, 12, 10 vote boxes. You know, that could have been a lot better. There you go, buddy. Hopefully you enjoy. I've just asked first in his full Omni where to start Slayer, and he's just given me a trade. Okay, all right. An animal bow. Thank you. I'll get you some ammo boxes. Yo, he's fully hooking me up right now. First, you fucking legend, man. What the heck? Oh, four ammo boxes, 64,000 regular M boxes, going straight to the bank of Jar Jar Bonks. Legend. That's all I gotta say. He just ran away. We're about to give the news on the Diddy account. He's going for number one and number eight. And if we look in the inventory, number one is three YouTube boxes and 20 Vindictive. It's all been traded to him. Shout out to first. There is no way I can end off this video without hitting the bong. Got a nice pink. It's actually the smallest bong I've got, believe it or not. It's not hard to believe. It's fucking tiny, but it hits like a truck. Got some green packed in this. Cheers, boys. Hopefully everyone in America had a good 4th of July. And this one goes out to you. Cheers. Yeah, yeah, they love to see you at your worst Stick the knife in where it hurts Fuck them all, I know my worth I'm cashing in for that purse I spent years in that dirt Now I'm taking chances, I'm building my own church They can't take away what you've been going through for years yes. But I'm back in this bitch overcoming these fears, fears. No hip hip hooray, I don't hear no cheers That's fine, I got six